NeoVim 0.11 just dropped, and it comes with some pretty major improvements to LSP support. You can start by throwing out your old LSP auto-completion plugin, because this functionality is now built into NeoVim. With auto-trigger set to true, I can just start typing and it will come up with the suggestions. I found the default behavior to be a bit annoying, so these additional lines of config are just my preferences. I'm not going to go over what they do in the video, and they're liable to change anyway, but if you're interested, go check out my dot .files. I'll try to print this string, so I'll go standard.debug.print and it fills in these um, function arguments for me, which is really nice and I can tab and shift tab between them. So I'll fill these in to print my string and then I'll realize that I have a typo in my variable name. So I'll go and hover over it and I'll type grn to rename the variable. NewVim 0.11 also introduces a new key binding for jumping to the implementation of something. For example, I have my trait here, foot, and I type GRI to show the implementations of foot, such as in foo and in bar. We've covered GRN, GRI, but there's also GRR and GRA. GRA executes the code action suggested under the cursor. So for example here, it's suggesting that I move this to a use statement. So I'll type 1 and hit enter, and it will do that for me. GRR doesn't really need explanation, it just shows the references to a variable. The new version also introduces these virtual line thingies, which are good for showing diagnostics, such as errors and warnings. So congrats to the NeoVim team and all who've contributed. I'm keen as beans to keep using it.